Good morning, middle school. Today is your daily bulletin for Friday, March 20th. Now, I'm a little nervous. I haven't done this on camera before. I'm always just on a telephone. Um, so this is your daily announcements because I have missed my morning gig. And so we're bringing it to you. Um, and I just want to say that this is a lovely first day of spring. Nice 20 degree weather, but it could be worse. We could be building snowmen. So I have here my little helpers today, Ebony and Ian. So we just have a few announcements that we're going to do, and then we have a challenge to leave you with. So just a reminder that the food distribution is going to happen today in the afternoon on the normal bus route. So if you are planning on getting food or if you usually get food, uh, you should let Mrs. Miller know um, how you want it distributed. But all you have to do is wait at the end of your driveway and they will, someone will get you the food. Um, and that starts today. Um, also, we're looking at doing... Just a second, Ebony. We're also looking at putting together Facebook, private Facebook pages for grade levels. Um, Miss Norman would be the person for fifth grade. I would do the sixth grade. And Mrs. Johnson will do seventh grade. Um, get a hold of one of us if you're interested, or there should be a link that would be pushed out through Google Classroom. Um, and also to wrap up today, it is Owen's birthday, and I would like to sing to Owen because I know everybody misses my singing, and Mrs. Ween's birthday was yesterday, and you know, I expected a phone call from her saying that she wanted me to sing to her, but she didn't, so we'll add her in on this one too. But I don't like to sing alone because I am kind of shy and quiet, as you know, so Evan and Ian are going to help me. You ready? Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Owen and Mrs. Ween and Elsie yesterday. Just a minute. So our Facebook challenge, our school challenge for everyone today in middle school, and even the K3 can join in. Um, play, pretend that you are want to take a rocket ship to get out of this pandemic. What would you build? Now we don't have Legos, so we built it out of magnet tiles. And I had to, I had um, some engineers help me, assistant engineers, and we have a limited number of potential applicants and two don't have thumbs so they were out so these two were the best two candidates so these are our rockets to get us out of here um, there's this one and this one and this one that's broken breaking in half so I'm not sure if that's safe but go ahead and build your rocket ship out of Legos, blocks, magnet tiles. If you don't have any of those, then draw it on paper and post a picture of it to this post so that we can no, all my turn. share it. No, it's my turn. Now, I also did a little literature um, pun in there. I don't know if any of you caught it when the two potential applicants didn't have thumbs, so they weren't qualified. What book was I refer referencing with that? Turn. Sixth grade, seventh grade, and any fifth grade or fourth grader who have read it. And what in the book was being referenced? You can let me know the answer. And when we get back to school, you can get a prize. So that's it for us. Have a great Friday. Have a great weekend. And hopefully we'll see you soon. No.